I'll try not to. <laughs> I'll try really hard. Well, art is what got me to California. Like, I would not be here who I am. And that meant a lot to me. And when I threw my first show in California, it was so crazy to see what I was capable of making in a year. Like, just the event itself. Where move into a whole new place where nobody knows you and then have a have an entire gallery show up and you know like basically sell out and it was ridiculous and it got me to Hawaii it's just so crazy I, I'm kind of burnt on art shows currently um, I worked in ad agencies <clears throat> doing pretty like run-of-the-mill stuff type design uh, where these people are stuck in a system where oh this this typeface has been working for seven years why would we change it having to fight against that type of mentality for a little bit of create, re creativity was pretty exhausting. The, the uninformed consumer is the biggest thing that I have a problem with. I don't, I don't like to think that my audience is stupid. I like to think that they're very intelligent and that they want to know what they're um, consuming. But it's not, a, it's not a common thread in the current, or when I was working specifically, like, it was never brought up, like, how, why should somebody buy something that we're spending all this time developing? It was just like, they're going to. And they're, they're not wrong, but it was just the mentality that I didn't get behind. This is the first studio I've ever had. Before this, I was always just painting in my garage or, like, painting in my bedroom or where I, where I was sleeping. I do murals and I also paint at my coffee shop every day, um, go out and, because it, it, it's a very uh, lonely environment sometimes and if you get stuck in your head too long, um, it gets a little crazy, you get a little, a little like fever about it, but um, I, I make it a point on my personal self to be out and about and it keeps me like, grounded relative to what I actually want to be talking about with my artwork. I pull from a lot of stuff, like I pull from Russian culture, Japanese culture, English, like, like African, but mainly I just try and make something that I would like to look at, that pleases me, you know, it makes me happy when I make it. So, whether or not that's like the style that is for somebody else or not, I don't really think about too much. 90% of the time, I just start drawing, like I, I don't really think about it too much. And I let it come out by itself. Like, but sometimes I'll be like out and about, and I'll have an idea that I want to try and express. But that's pretty rare. Like, I, I pull from my own experience all the time. Like, what's going on in my life? What I'm dealing with? Like, what people say to me? Like, what sticks out when I'm out and about?